Okay, back on again. So walking inside the front door, uh, you have a, uh, this is linoleum entryway, carpeted flooring. The walls, it's probably going to be kind of hard to tell, but the walls are a, uh, a beige color and the ceiling is white. Two light fixtures up there and that's a central air conditioning um, outlet right there. And uh, I, I suspect that you could probably take those light fixtures down and hang ceiling fans from there if you wanted to. Carpet appears to be in pretty decent condition. And you've got the blinds, plastic blinds on the windows, or are they metal? Let me check. No, they're plastic blinds on the windows. And standing in the far corner of the living room area here, there's your kitchen. Refrigerator with the ice and water dispenser. Cabinets, again, linoleum uh, tile on the flooring. There's a couple of scuff marks on here. Uh, I don't know if that'll come up or not. Uh, I guess probably will. It just looked like it came off with my toe, so it may scrub off. Got your range. There is no microwave above there. Um, dishwasher. Stainless steel sink. And storage closet. And here's the space for your refrigerator over here. And I don't think there's much room. You know, you were talking about maybe making more room for a fridge, but I think we're pretty maxed out over here on this one. And the cubic capacity of this refrigerator is hmm. In fact, there's no sticker on this one. No, there's one on the inside, but it's not on there anymore. Somebody scraped it off. Anyway, well, I don't know. You just kind of have to judge it for yourself, I guess. Uh, I don't know if yours, you know, you were talking about moving walls or something, but I just don't know if that's possible here. All right. All right, we'll go check out the garage right through this area here. Yeah, electricity is off, sorry about that. So I can tell you, you may be able to see that there, your washer and dryer outside here, along with your hot water tank. There's some shelves put in, you got your electric garage door opener. They've even got a TV mounted out here. I guess that's something that may stay with the property. Two car garage. Overall, uh, it was rated as above average condition. I'd say it probably is. It looks decent. Okay, so again, your front door over here, going up, uh, you have a little nook over here for something. Not much room, but uh, you have your half bath right over here. Just a sink and a toilet. Same color scheme throughout the house, it looks like beige walls and a white ceiling linoleum tile and then the carpet up the stairs doesn't look too bad it looks like it's a you know the carpet's a little bit aged but you know the house itself isn't brand new so it's to be expected light fixture smoke detector um, filter for your central air conditioning unit got a linen cabinet up here at the top of the stairs and one full bathroom right here sink and vanity Again, linoleum tile, just the basics. Bathtub, shower. Then we'll go to this side of the house here. Got your uh, closet with the sliding um, double mirror doors over here. Kind of a sloppy paint job up there, but that may be able to be fixed. Telephone outlet, uh, view out the back window. This is those, those were those uh, uh, visitor parking stalls that we looked at earlier before we came in. All right, back out into the hallway here. Second extra bedroom. Looks to be about the same size as the first one. Same view, back to the back side of the house and then your uh, sliding doubled mirror doors here. And then heading into the master bedroom. Decent size, master bedroom's a pretty darn nice size here. For only a, a thousand and fifty square foot uh, townhouse, not bad. Of course, you have your telephone jack in here, a couple of windows on the side, and then your main front window overlooks the uh, post office and the shopping center there. 
Actually, you have an ocean view from here, believe it or not. I don't know if you could see it on the video. Right over the top of all the buildings, you could see the ocean there. Area over here to put your uh, TV. There's a cable jack there. And the master bath. Again, double vanity sinks over here. Mirror, light fixture. There's your shower and bathtub. And then the toilet over here. And again, generally speaking, it looks like it's in above average condition. And one medicine cabinet on this side. Okay, and uh, again, a light fixture over here. I'm not sure if it's um, if it's uh, if they just hook this up for a light fixture or if they put the proper hardware up there for you to be able to put a ceiling fan in. I'm not sure. Um, Walk-in closet here for the master. And there is attic access here. I don't know how much room there is up there, but there is access. And the closet goes goes a little bit ways around the corner there. Decent size. And one thing I do want to point out in these two bedrooms, there is no um, ceiling fan or light fixture. Okay, that's it. And you shall see this posted shortly.